uh, right there in Highlands And here's what, what we understand right now from ABC News is that two suspects are in custody. ABC News is reporting um, multiple injuries, we, and we don't know that for ourselves right now. Again, we have we have crews trying to work that information, but again, this is that STEM school in Douglas County. Um, so two suspects we understand that are in custody right now. Let's get Tully back on the phone. I apologize, Tully. I'm so sorry about your kids. I'm sure it's a it's a Kelly. Excuse me. A, a, a tough day for you and so explain to us once again what you were what you were experiencing um well like i was saying i i got a text from a friend who is actually in there um and she said guns shooting oh my god oh my god and then she could hear them um and that's how i knew that's the first how i knew um and then the next thing i know i, I heard from my son who was calling me because all of the kids who were in the middle school um uh, study hall all immediately ran out of the building and and tons more and got safely to rock bottom and they were fortunate to have people with them that called them and that's and I immediately came to rock bottom so I'm watching as tons of cars are coming um, and and ambulances and I mean you just see a sea of um, of lights. And Kelly, stay with us. I want to read a, a tweet from our colleague Clayton Sandell, uh, who works in the ABC News Bureau. Uh, Kelly, stay with us, please. Uh, he just reported that a high-ranking law enforcement source says multiple victims have been shot at a school there. We're talking about STEM school. Two suspects in custody, and police say they are, quote, engaging a third. So you said you have two students at that school, Kelly? Yes, one is out safe. I still have my third grader in there. Oh. My. And and are you getting any information from the school as to what you were supposed to do, what other parents are supposed to do, Kelly? No, we've um, we've gotten a text from um, from the Douglas County School Board, and it is actually their policy to do to just stay where they are and keep them keep the baby safe, keep these kids safe. Um, I need the school to stay and keep my kids safe and let the law enforcement do what they're supposed to do. Absolutely. Absolutely, Kelly. So what and, and what what did your your fifth grader uh, again walk us through what what he or she told you? I'm sorry. Uh, say that one more time. Your your fifth grader. What did uh, your son, sixth your daughter, grader. sixth grader? I'm my sorry. Son, my sixth grade son. Yes. And 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 tell exactly what what you have heard from him. Um, would you like to speak with him? Yeah, if, if he's there, thank you.